Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Gabriela. How are you? I'm fine. Thank you. And you? I'm just fine. Just fine. You know. How's everything? Tell me. Well, almost finished the day in my work. <laughs> almost finished your day at work. Yeah. At work. So, uh, for the next few minutes, I'm just listening. Sería así o no sería así? Yeah, yeah, no, that's okay, no problem. Okay, teacher, aquí lo voy a estar escuchando, prestando atención a la clase. That's fine, that's fine. <laughs> excellent, excellent. Okay. Angelica, good evening. How are you? Hi, good evening. Very well. In my house. Oh, really? You are at home? Yes. We be, be happy in... Uh, with my daughter. Okay, that's nice. That's it's nice. Nice as his favorite. Is your what? Y no sé cómo se dice espacio. Es mis mis in my space. Space. Space favorite. No, in my, my favorite house. space. Repeat. In my. In my favorite space. Okay, in my favorite space. Yo soy de las que disfruta estar en casa. Oh, really? You enjoy yes. being home? That's nice. Yes. That's excellent, that's excellent. Tell me, what time did you finish working? Today, um... Uh, Sears. One, two, three. Three is la cosa. <laughs> three. A three? You finish working at three? Terminó trabajar yes. a Oh, that's yes. nice. Yes. Ya, ya tenía hoy ocho días que no salí esa hora. <laughs> oh, that's great. That's great. Yes. That's excellent. That's just excellent. Oh, yes. And tell me, how was your day? Everything fine? Um, excellent. Very good. Okay. Okay, that's nice. That's just nice. And tell me, what about tomorrow? What time are you going to start working tomorrow? Uh, morning. Go to work at uh, 10. I, no, at night. The nine, nine, uh, nine uh, six. 
from nine to six. Uh -huh. Nine to six. Okay. Oh, that's fine. Yeah. This can book. Yeah, it's good to rest, right? Yes. It is always good, very good to rest. Well, yes. nice, nice having you here. Um, it's good. It is good to have you here in class. It's good to maintain. No, understand. It is good to have you here in class. You were not in online class. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Well, thank you very much and welcome. Thank you. To you. It's to you. Let's see. Atenas, good evening. How are you? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you? Um, so so. How was your day? Um, go to the CNR and Corte Suprema de Justicia, Oficialía Mayor, Relaciones Exteriores, en eh, revisar, check, check de check. emails, en contract, en other activities. En some other activities, that's nice. So you were busy today. Tu ocupado. No. Yes. Well, that's great. That's just great. And what time did you finish working? What time did you finish working today? Mm, seven, seven PA, PM, pardon. At 7 p.m. It's correct. Well, that's nice. Well, no, it's not nice. 7 p.m. is late. Why did you finish working so late? Finish. Finish working. Yeah. And no entendí si me dijo a qué horas terminé o qué fue lo último que hice. What time did you finish working? Ah, a qué horas okay. terminé de trabajar? A la a seven seven o'clock. Okay, well that's late. Eso es tarde. Sí. Why did you finish so late? Okay. Why? Uh huh. Why? Why did you finish so late? Por qué tan tarde? Oh. Eh, bueno, tenía trabajo pendiente porque se arruinó la impresora en, el, en la oficina, entonces me tocó venir a imprimir a casa y estuve con prueba y error hasta que logré imprimir. Oh, really? That's bad when, when the, the, the equipment starts giving problems, right? Because, I mean, uh, you... You have your stuff like ready and everything set, and then to have problems like that, it's, uh, it's not No good. sé qué tienen esos aparatos, pero como que cuando uno los necesita más, siempre se arruina. Yeah. O falla. That happens. That happens. I understand you totally. Well, Atenas, welcome. Nice having you here. Thank you, teacher. 
Okay, guys, just give me one second, please. Okay, let's see who else is around. Marvin, good evening. How are you? Good evening, teacher. How's everything? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How's everything? ¿Qué tal todo? Very good. Okay, okay. And tell me, how was your day? me dijo, me. How was your day? Tell me, tell me, dígame, ¿qué tal su día? Pesado, working. Heavy. Heavy, heavy. Oh, really? A heavy day at work? A heavy day at work? A heavy day at the work? At work? At the work? A heavy day at the work? Yeah, that's, that's bad. And tell me, what time did you finish working? Uh, seven o'clock. You finish working at seven o'clock. See. Sí. Okay. Well, but you are early at home. Pero yo temprano a casa. Eh, pagamos taxi con el compañero. <laughs> oh, really? Si <laughs> sí, no ya viene wow. la trabazón. <laughs> That's nice. Yeah, oh. it's a problem. Traffic nowadays is problematic. A lot. Traffic hoy en día es un día. Más en la carretera de los chorros. Oh, yeah, I can imagine. I can imagine. It's terrible, right? It is terrible. Sí, terrible. Yes. Well, but it's so nice to have you here. Welcome. Repeat. It's so nice to have you here. Welcome. So much. Es muy bueno tenerlo acá. Bienvenido. Ah, thank you, teacher. Oh, you're welcome. Xiomara, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you? I'm fine. Thank you. And you? Just fine, just great, you know. Here, ready to Thanks. start with you guys. Tell me, how was your day? Um, my day um, inició a, bueno, salí de mi casa tempranito, la, antes de las cinco, de antes de, after five o'clock. Really? Um, Para, para, ajá, para una reunión y, en, en oficina. Luego, ay, no, no puedo. Luego regreso a mi then, a pharmacy. Then, then, back to the pharmacy. pharmacy. Back to the pharmacy. Eh, 
y ahí pues usual y um, hacer uh, cash cut um, revisar um, papelería el clean um, metas la, ventas revisar ventas Already. Mm -hmm. So you were very, pretty busy. Muy ocupada. Uh, no listen. Very busy. Very busy. Muy ocupada. Yes. Okay. okay. What time did you get home? ¿A qué hora llegó a casa? Um, seven o'clock. Okay. Well, it's a good time. It's una buena hora. It's a good no time. Welcome. It's a good time. Welcome to the class. Ah, uh, thank you, teacher. Thank you, teacher. No, thanks to you. Welcome. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Maria Teresa, good evening. How are you? Good evening, teacher. Very good. Here in my house, resting. Okay, in your house, resting. That's nice. Resting, yes. That's great, that's great. And how was your day? Um, a little tired, but, but satisfied it, um, because we saw a lot today. Oh, really? Yes. That's nice. Yes. So you have a good day because you were selling goods, you say. Excuse me? You had a good day because you sell a lot. Yes. <laughs> yes. 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 Okay, well, and what time do you get into your job? What time do you check in? A qué hora centro? Yep. Um, quiero ver. Today, um, ¿cómo, ¿cómo se dice entre? Today. I checked in. I checked in. Um, una, una PM. One, at 1 p.m. At 1 p.m. Ahí no es necesario el o'clock, ¿verdad, teacher? Solo es no. at 1 p.m. Yes, you can say it like that. Ajá. Uh -huh. Ah, ok. Ok. You checked in at 1 p.m. At what time did you finish? Al, uh, puedo decir, I finish. I finish it. I finished. I finished um, seven or oh, thirty minutes past uh, seven. Thirty minutes past seven. Okay, mm -hmm. that's nice. It was a. It was not a long day for you at work. No fue tan largo el día de trabajo. Mm, no, pero trabajo desde casa. <laughs> <laughs> ah, that's no, why. No, a veces la otra mitad la hago en la casa. <laughs> Tenemos horarios rotativos, teacher. Okay, that's why, that's why. Well, it's cool, you know. Yes. It's nice that that you have that opportunity yes yeah. 
because I mean, uh, going to the work, traffic, stuff like that is difficult. Ir al trabajo, tráfico y todo eso. Sometimes it's complex. Sí. Mi trabajo está cerca de casa. Es este, quizás a unos 15 minutos. Oh my gosh. That's very close. Eso sí. es muy cerca. Sí. Y como viaja en moto. <laughs> oh my gosh. Even <laughs> faster. Aún más fácil. Sí, pero igual a veces cuando cierro las siete y media vengo corriendo, pues por, porque ya por la clase y todo. <laughs> yeah, but it's not like, like you say, like, wow, how terrible. No es que se diga, uy, qué terrible. <laughs> sí, no. No se me complica mucho como otro, ¿verdad? Yeah, of course, I mean. Sí. Well, for some, for some people, the traffic, uh, it's a problem. Pobre Marvin. Yeah. <laughs> no, no debería de ir, ¿verdad, teacher? <laughs> yeah, why going? <laughs> Yeah, there's no need for him to go. Maria Teresa, welcome to the class. Nice having you here. Thank you, teacher. Okay, let's see. Let's see who else is around. Katia, good evening. Mm -hmm. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How's everything? Evening. How are you? Very well. I um, finished the finished dinner. Acabo de cenar. <laughs> oh, really? Finished dinner. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Ya lista, ya ready <laughs> para la clase. That's great. Mm -hmm. Yes. That's just excellent. Excellent. Well, let's see. And tell me, how was your day? What did you do today? Mm, muy bien, productivo el día, gracias a Dios. Y echándole ganas siempre. Okay. It was a productive day. Say with me. It was a productive mm. day. I was. Así se dice en inglés. I was. It was a productive day. Voy a anotar. It was a productive day. I was. It was. It was. It was. Okay. It was. A production day. Productive. Productive. Yep. Productive day. Thank you, teacher. Productive no, day. thanks to you. Thanks to you. Y su día, ¿cómo estuvo, teacher? My day. Mm. Let's see. Let's see. My day was very, I mean, just routine, let's see. Uh, I woke up early, I arrived to my job at 6.30. I was working, teaching almost all day long until 4 p.m. I came home at 5, rested a little bit. I went to the gym. Mm -hmm. Then... Uh, let's see, I went to the gym from 6 to 7.15. I came back and now in class. Muchas cosas. Yeah. Muy bien. Quite busy, quite busy. I mean, it's good to be busy. Mm. Estar ocupado. Sí. Qué bueno, qué bueno. Lo bueno que está ahí dándonos clase ya. Yeah, I mean. It's 
it's good to be here. It's good to be here with you guys. Thank you very much, Kathy, and welcome. Best. Thank you, teacher. Thank you. Let's see. Claudia, good evening. Claudia, hello. Let's see who else is around. Karen, hmm. good evening. How are you? Okay, Karen perhaps is not available. And Braulio, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you, mister? Ah, very good. Good to okay, well, How was good your day? day? A good day at work? What? Was it a good day at work? Fue un buen día en el trabajo. Ah, atareado. Heavy. Okay. Nah. You know that happens. That happens. What can we do? ¿Qué le vamos Working a hacer? Forever. Yeah. Working forever. <laughs> Así nos toca, teacher. Yeah, yeah. That's the way it goes. Pero aquí estamos en la clase. Yeah, I know, I know what you mean. That's the way it goes. But, as you say, what can we do about it? ¿Qué le vamos a hacer? Yes. We gotta, we gotta work. There's no option. There's yes, no option. We need to work. No exceptional. <laughs> How are you, teacher? I'm just fine, just fine. I had a a nice day, a very interesting day. Working forever. Well, no, 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 no. It was my microphone. I was checking the other microphone, but it's not working properly. Ah, okay. It's not working uh, properly. Uh, that happens. Yes? Yeah, yeah. Just a lot, teacher. No, I have dinner when I finish the class. Yeah. Yep. I I don't usually have dinner early. No solo cenar temprano. Ah, it ah eggs the the gallina. And no, no, no. That's not good. That's not good. That's you know you got bad influences from your co-work from your classmates. Se tiene mala influencia con sus compañeros. Dos. Things are not good. Eso no es bueno. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. Guys, thank you very much, bro. Leon, welcome. Thank you, teacher. Let's see. Let me get the, the attendance, guys. Please.
Let me just check on something. Okay, Ana Maritza Flores Cervellón. Present. Angélica Guadalupe Tobar de Melgar. Present. Braulio Enrique Hernández Sosa. Present, teacher. Brian Alexander Rivas Sánchez. Claudia Teresa Flamenco. Elisa Saraí Martínez Ramírez. Esmeralda Lisbeth Vázquez Silva. Gabriela Guadalupe Salaya Sayas. Present teacher. Teacher. Yeah. I'm, I move on. Yeah, no problem. Okay. Karen de Sirem Ingibar de Sánchez. Catherine Beatriz Morales Calzadilla. Katia Estefanía Pineda Alvarado. Present teacher. María Teresa González de Lemos. Present teacher. Marvin Gabriel Romero Cubías. Present teacher. Milton Antonio García Castellanos. Uh, Mirna Present. Atenas Vanega Zamora. Present. Rebeca del Carmen Morales Molina. Víctor Manuel Reyes Carvajal en Xiomara Chamilet, Mendoza, Mendoza. Present teacher. Thank you. Now let's see. Elisa, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Hello, hello. How are you? I... Okay, so so you said. So so. Okay, why? How was your day? What else was it? Today relax. Hoy descansé así se dice. Oh really? Yes. That's nice, that's nice. Excellent, and what did you do today? Mm. I... I... House chores, I did house chores. I did house chores. I did? House chores. House chores. <laughs> I did house chores. Well, the good thing is that you're here at home, at, I mean in class, I'm sorry. That's a good thing. Eso es lo bueno, that we have you here in class and you are ready to participate. Está lista para participar. Hello, Elisa. I watched the dishes. Okay, I did the dishes, excellent. I'm off in the floor. Um, I buy. Um, and I see that uh, it. I'm sorry. Este, <laughs> comprar algunas cosas para comer. Okay, uh, groceries. I bought some groceries. Let, let me text it for you. Déjeme escribirse, okay? Okay. 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 Okay.
Goes like this. No me agarra señal fácil. I bought La some groceries. Like this. Okay. I bought some groceries. Or you can say, I bought some food. Now, the difference is this. La diferencia entre I bought some groceries and I bought some food is this one. La diferencia es esta. If you say I bought some groceries, it's stuff that you can cook. Son cosas que usted puede cocinar. If you say I bought some food, se entendería de que usted compró no comestibles. Comida. Comida. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. Perfect, perfect. Excellent. You got the... You got everything ready. Excellent, excellent. Well, okay. thank you very much, Alisa. Guys, okay. give me 30 seconds, please. Hoy yo le voy a dar la clase. Se desconectó el teacher. Me dijo no, que yo le di la clase. Empieza. Que le llevamos unos minutos. Que empiece. Unos segundos, ah, sí. Que empiece. Mis. Que van, vaya dale. teacher. Vaya nueva teacher. Let's Pongan go, boys. No está grabando, guys. Yes, I am recording everything. Everything is being recorded. Todo está grabado. Shame on you, guys. Shame on you. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. Well, guys, uh, as you know, today we start a new a new lesson, right? Today we start lesson number, unit number three. Unit number three is quite interesting. And today we are going to talk about information, questions, and answers. What's that? Well, it's something, something very, very simple, okay? Uh, let me see. Let me just check something. Okay, never mind. Well, as I told you today, tonight we are going to work with information questions. Como les decía, ahora vamos a trabajar con information questions. Eh, the information questions are different because right now we have worked with just yes, no question. Hemos trabajado con preguntas de sí o no, right? In grammar, in the grammar. But today we're going to start watching the structure of something that we know already. Vamos a la estructura de algo que, que ya entendemos. Okay. We know it, ya lo manejamos. Information questions, what's that? Well, you need to remember what, okay, where, donde, when, cuando, how, como. We do it, no? We use them. Las usamos. Why are they called information questions? Well, they are also called WH questions. También se les conoce como WH questions. Why are they called like that? They're called information questions because when we place them in a sentence, we are requesting for information. We are asking for information. We are expecting the other person to give us information. Like, uh, let's see, mm. Atenas, please open your mic. Ready. 
Okay. What is your full name? My full name is Mirna Tenas Banega Zamora. Okay, where do you live, Atenas? I live in San Salvador. Okay, where do you work? I work in Homie SLCB. Okay, are you married, married or single? I married. Okay. How long have you been married? Um, one year, two years, three years? Seven, seven years. Seven years, okay, for seven years, that's nice. Uh, how many kids do you have? Uh, one, one kid, one son. How old is your son? Sorry? How old is your son? Ah, uh, uh, four, four, four years. He is four, four years, years old. Okay, sí. yes. perfect. Okay, if you see, very simple, right? Thank you very much, Atenas. You are so very kind. Welcome, teacher. Okay, if you see, it's very simple, right? What was I requesting from her? Specific information. ¿Qué les Información específica. That's the way we use the WH questions. When we want to request specific information from another person. Okay. Now, uh, that's going to be like the main topic for today, but we are going to work it from the manual. Okay. So we are going to work it in a, in a different way. Now, we are going to start working tonight in your manuals in page uh, number 29. But first, we are going to solve the first exercise. I'm going to show it to you. In your manuals, in page number 29, we have the name of the unit is, uh, where do you work? What are we going to do? Well, we are going to be able to describe the different departments in your workplace and what they do. So now to start, let's make a small brainstorm about the different departments in your workplace. Okay, first brainstorm about the different departments on your workplace. So let's see. Now, how many different departments are there in your workplace, in your company? What about in your case, uh, Maria Teresa? Are there different departments, a distinct department in the company? Well, all of you guys, because it's your company, right? Yes, Maria Perdón, Teresa, teacher, tell me. Como dijo, perdón. Are there, what are the departments, the departments on your company? ¿Cuáles son los distintos departamentos en su company? Tell me one. Pero, departamentos como, teacher, de... Areas. Areas. Accounting. Uh, Contabilidad. Contabilidad. Eh, okay. Accounting. Accounting. Okay. Um, este, compras. ¿Cómo se dice compras? Sales. No, 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 no. No, no, no eso es vender, vender, perdón. Yeah. Este, compras sería área de compras, ¿cómo puedo decir? Purchases. Uh, purchase. Purchase. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, sería el área de recursos humanos. Ok. Purchase, me dijo, ¿verdad? Yep. ¿Y eso sería, significa solo compras o área de compras? 
No, no, no. Purchase department. Department. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Y es el de contabilidad, como dijo teacher. Accounting. Account. Accounting. Puede escribir ese, por favor. There you go. Okay, thank you, Maria Teresa. Guys, any other department? The rest of you. The rest of ustedes. Is there any other department you can tell me about? Departamento de Mercadeo. Oh, marketing. That's marketing department. También se encuentra okay. laboratorio. Okay. You can say just lab or you can say laboratory. El área de bodega y distribución también. Okay. Warehouse. No, I got two words for you. Tengo dos palabras para ustedes. Warehouse and storeroom. What's the difference? ¿Cuál es la diferencia? Warehouse is the big one from the company. Es la grande que tiene la compañía. But perhaps in the branches, pero quizás en las, en las salas, tengan una storeroom, tengan una bodeguita, una bodega pequeña. That's mm -hmm. storeroom. Okay? It's different. Because warehouse is like the general one, or a big one. Es una grande. Okay? Okay. Is there any other department that you can remember? Hello? No other? Okay. Uh, Online, online medic. Oh, really? Yes. Mm. That's call called center. center. They, yeah, that's called center. Okay, that word called center doesn't exist. Eso no se pronuncia así. Call center. The letter T after N. No sound. La letra T después de la N no debe de tener un sonido. Call center. It's like in this case. Otro ejemplo sería esto. Look. Internet. Internet. Okay. Letter T after N doesn't have a sound. La letra T después de la N no tiene sonido. Okay, now let me ask. Uh, hmm. oh, just give me a second, guys. Just... Distribution. Okay, distribution department. Excellent. Departamento Sistemas, System. Okay, no, that's... Uh, TI department. Okay, give me just a second, give me just a second. Well, actually, we are going to use that, uh, el de soporte técnico lo vamos a trabajar luego. It's a whole lesson. We are going to talk about that. Relax. Okay. So, there are many different departments. Now, let's see. Marvin, which department do you belong to? Repeat. Which is your department? ¿Cuál es departamento? Which department do you belong to? Sería departamento de ventas. Okay, sales, sales department. Sales department. Okay, yep. 
Katia, what about you? Which is your department? Uh, sales department, I mean. Also, Atenas, sí. which is your department? Legal department. Legal, legal. L legal. Like that, perfect. Okay, let's see. Uh, 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 mm. Angelica, yours? Which is your department? Uh, to sell department in pharmacy. Okay. Maria Teresa? Sell department. Okay. Remember that there's also a There's also customer service. Servicio al cliente. That's another area. Okay, well, nice. Let's jump into the next activity. Vamos a la siguiente activity because we have a lot to do. Now, the, la, the next question, okay. The next activity, it's a small exercise that we are going to do. And it goes like this, let's see. Okay. Okay, guys, exercise. We're in page number 29 on your manuals. Listen to your teacher read the following departments in a company. Then match them with the activities they perform. We have production, research and development, purchase, marketing, human resources management, accounting and finance, Research and identify what customers want and need at the right place. Recruit, select, and train new employees for the right job in the company. Keep the financial record of transactions involving monetary inflows and outflows. Control and supervise the production workforce and inventory. Develop, design new or improve existing products or processes. Buy and acquire raw materials, production equipment, etc., for the use of the organization. Okay, what are you going to do? Match. Okay, that's the exercise. You are going to place the number according to the space. So how are we going to do it? I'm going to send it to working groups, those mandatory groups, and you're going to solve this exercise, okay? Okay, groups are created, please. Let's do it. Vaya. Es de buscarle la, el, ¿cómo es que se llama? La función de cada uno de los departamentos. Sí. Marketing. ¿Cuánto tienes? Cinco. Anda, trae el cargador. Solo te va a durar un minuto, mi hijo. Controla y... Y supervisa la producción. Supervision. 
Es producción en la 1, creo yo. Porque es el control and super base que controla y supervisa la producción. En medio entiendo. Va. Inventarios, uh -huh. veo que dice. Uh -huh. Dice, diseña lo, e improvisa la existencia de los productos y los procesos. Dice, compra y adquiere los materiales de la producción, el equipo y los usa en la organización, para usarlos en la organización. Pero, Atenas, mire, re, 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 reciar, and, ¿cómo es? La segunda, reciar and, Research. La segunda, eh, como estoy viendo, que materiales de producción, equipo que compra, dice, sería la segunda. La dos es este human, human resource. Employer, ajá, ¿eh? recursos humanos. Ajá, es la cinco, pero es la número dos, entiendo acá, o sea, la segunda en la, en la lista. Sí, pero vamos a poner el número o el nombre. Pues como el espacio está chiquito, yo el número. El puesto. número. Yeah, just the number, just the number. Ah, pero es el Solo nombre. El number, ah, number. Ah, verdad. Sí, el número. El, num el, num el número va. Sí, el número. Yeah. Vaya. Vaya, las transacciones monetarias. Este las hace finanzas. Finance. ¿Cuál es esa? La 6 sí. es la... Quite, finish record of... Ajá, ajá, entiendo que esa es la 6. Keep the financial. Financial. La 2, la 6. La Ajá, es la número 3. Porque se keep the financial record Ajá, of inflation. In bowling, monetary, in flux. Uh, sí. Flux. La 6 y la 3. Ajá. Res, ya, y then, wash, customer, one, and need a the right place. Dice, control y supervisa la producción. Yo creo que... Ah, eso es lo que estaba diciendo. Control and supervisor de production, workforce and inventory. Es la uno. Controla y supervisa la producción. Work, work force, ¿qué significa? Work force, eh, fuerza de trabajo. Ah, sí. <ríe> Inventaria. Sí, sería la primera, la, la cuatro. Es la primera. Teacher, una pregunta. Yeah. ¿Qué significa la número tres? Ah, eso estaba no, bien. No, no, no. Departamento de compras, dijo usted, va. 
No, okay. no, no. El, el departamento número 3 que aparece en el listado. El, el, Escuchar sin sí. ese. Él lo dijo hace ratito, creo yo. Ok. Uh, purchasing. Compras. Ah, no, hombre. ¿A qué se va? Ah, yo puse atención. Si se compra y adquiere los materiales de producción, ah, pues compras el 3, o sea, el último. Por eso el 6 del 3. El... Vaya, no me como una cosa. El último, el, el que dice buy and acquire. And adquire materiales, producción, equipamiento. Ajá, ese es este compras. Por eso el 6. La respuesta, digamos, de están en la 6. No, Marvin. O sea, es, es, ajá, si sí es la número 6 de, de, las, de los que están no, por eso, describiendo. Vaya, por, Marvin, guachises, guachises. No, vaya, lo que ella le dice es que el número 3 lo va a colocar a la par de buy and acquire. Exacto. Sí, raw por eso materials. Le digo, vaya. In the ajá, last por eso que quiere material y todo eso. Uh -huh. Quien compra todo eso es el departamento de compra. Bueno, todos los insumos de, de, de la empresa los, los compra el departamento de compra. Este control y supervisión. La... Control y supervisión de producción. Por eso la controlan supervisión. Como clientas. Ajá, como servicio al cliente. Recluta, busca, identifica clientes que necesiten. Falta la Research, investigar, investigar. Research, research. Research, investigar. equipment. For the use on the organization. Hey guys, there's Esmeralda here. Ya vino Esmeralda. Okay, okay, thank you, teacher. Hello, good evening. Good evening, hello.
Okay, let's see, guys. Welcome, Esmeralda. Hello. Okay, guys, let me get the attendance. Okay, let's see. Ana Maritza Flores Servillon. Present. Angélica Guadalupe Tobar de Melgar. Present. Braulio Enrique Hernández Sosa. Present, teacher. Brian Alexander Rivas Sánchez. Claudia Teresa Flamenco. Cesar ahí Martínez Ramírez. Esmeralda Liz, thank you, Lisa. Esmeralda Lisbeth Vázquez Silva. Present teacher. Gabriela Guadalupe Celaya Sayas. Present teacher. Karen de Cire Menjibar de Sánchez. Catherine Beatriz Morales Calzadilla. Katia Estefanía Pineda Alvarado. Present teacher. María Teresa González de Lemos. Present teacher. Marvin Gabriel Romero Cubías. Present teacher. Milton Antonio García Castellanos. Miren Atenas Vanegas Zamora. Present. Rebeca del Carmen Morales Molina. Thank you. Víctor Manuel Reyes Carvajal. And Shimara Shamilet Mendoza Mendoza. Present teacher. Okay. Perfect, guys. Let's continue. Next activity. No, 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 no. We are going to solve the exercise. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. My bad. It was a very interesting exercise. Oh. Okay. Let's see. Oopsie. We are right here. Okay. Number one. Production. What is production, Marvin? Production, me dijo, ¿verdad? Yep. Eh, sería la cuatro, control and surface, the production, uh -huh. inventory. Inventory. Perfect. Control, production is control and supervise the production, ¿Cómo? workforce and inventory. Perfect, thank you. Control and supervise the production workforce and number two research and development. Okay, uh, Atenas, your turn. No sé si me equivoqué, pero yo tengo ahí develop, design new or improve it. Ex Ay, no sé cómo se pronuncia. Existencia. Ex okay, develop, design, new, or improve existing. Existing products or process. Processes. Processes. Okay, that's number two. Perfect. Now, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Number three, purchasing. That one goes to Ana Maritza. I don't understand. understand, sorry. Okay, Ana Maritza, number three, purchasing. Thank you, no problem, no problem. Don't worry. Uh, let's see. Esmeralda, number three. Uh, 
yo, bueno, ahorita ni le he hecho. Eh, sería quizás la última que comprar, okay. que te tengo de me atrevería. En inglés, please, en inglés, en inglés, en inglés. Buy, um, no sé cómo decir esa palabra. Acquire, acquire. Buy, acquire, right, mat materials, production. Materials. Et materials production equipment 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 etc for the use for the organ organiz, organization oh, organization organization okay that's perfect that's number three purchasing is to buy and acquire raw raw materials production equipment etc for the use of the organization excellent number four marketing maria teresa number four is yours um Yo creo que esa la tuvimos mal, teacher, porque nosotros le habíamos puesto la, la donde va la dos. Ok, well, it's not that one. Which one do you think? ¿Cuál cree usted? Este, marketing, quiero ver, sería... I'll help you. Te voy a ayudar. It's one of these. It's one of these three. Mm -hmm. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Okay, <laughs> look. It, it, it goes this. It goes this. Please, read it. Um, marketing, research, and ident ident ¿cómo se dice? identify. Identify. Identify what customers um, Customers want and need at the right place. Very well. Research and identify, identify, identify. what customers want and need at the right place. Yes, that's the job or marketing. Number five, human resources management. Braulio, you got human resources management. Number five. Yep. Eh, sería recursos humanos. Eh, Recruit, select and train new employees for the right jobs in the company. Okay, very well. It is recruit select and train new employees for the right job in the company. Perfect. Now let's see, Xiomara, you got accounting and finance. Please read it. We know that we got, it goes here. Con gusto, teacher. Um, sería um, keep, keep the uh -huh. financial record of transactions involving in monetary and flows and outflows flows okay perfect accounting and finance keep the financial record of transactions involving monetary inflows and outflows okay i will repeat one more time for you guys production control and supervise the production workforce and inventory research and development Develop, design new or improve existing products or processes. Purchase. Buy and acquire raw materials, production equipment, etc., for the use of the organization. Marketing. Research and identify what customers want and need at the right place. Human resources management. Recruit, select, and train new employees for the right job in the company. Accounting and finance. Keep the financial record of transactions involving monetary inflows and outflows. 
Okay, very well done. Okay, okay, okay. Now, next exercise. Let me just get rid of this. Okay, then we have the explanation. As I told you, we have the questions, the information questions. What do I do? Where do you work? When do we go to the meetings? How do they plan the marketing? What time do you take breakfast? Okay, now. Let's see, let's see, let's see. <laughs> okay, remember we have the WH questions, which are also called, la cual también se les llama, information questions. Okay, it's the same. What are these? Okay, we must remember they are used to ask for specific information. You know, you need to remember this. They are used to ask for specific information. Okay, which one are they? We got what? Well, we got where? Where you know that it asks uh, for a place. It, it is asking for a place or location, right? We got when? When it is used to ask for a time. We got, let's see what, where, oh, we got why. You know that why is asking for a reason. We also got who. Who is used to ask for person. We have expressions like what time, but you know it's specific time, right? But we also have how, okay? Like how are you? How old are you? So something very special is this. Something that you need to remember is this, that why In the case of why, this one needs to be answered with I'm sorry. needs to be answered with because. Este necesita ser contestado con because, okay? All the time. So these are the WH questions. Let me just send you what I just did. Déjenme mandarles lo que acabo de hacer. Okay, let's see, man. Oh, here we go.
Perfect. I just sent it to you. Just a little So you can have it there. Okay, okay. But before we do the exercises, we are going to make something different. Okay? Because you also need to be practicing. Okay? So let me see. Okay, okay, okay. Give me a second. Aunque tenía por aquí ya archivadas las preguntas que le iba a hacer. Okay. Today we are going to talk about privacy, okay? This is something very, very interesting. This is something pretty interesting. You know, privacy is something that everybody is interested in. And something that also worries us, right? So, like uh, social media is something, is somewhere where we, I mean, somebody can invade our privacy, right? So we must be very careful how we manage our accounts, how we control the information we make public. Now with, nowadays, that is something very tricky. And yes, I hope you can do So, these are the questions we are going to be using. Can you see them? What are your privacy settings on Facebook? Like in my case, everything is private, okay? How can using social networking sites inv invade your privacy? What do you think about being fingerprinted when you enter a country? Okay, and the last one, I'm sorry, the last one, no. Just the first three. La primera three, What are your privacy setting on Facebook? How can using social networking sites invite your, invade your privacy? What do you think about being fingerprinted when you enter a country? So let's the first three. How? Come. We're going to work in big groups. Vamos a trabajar en grupos grandes. Okay. Three groups. Let me just check something. Okay. Group number one. Atenas, Claudia, Maria Teresa, Marvin, and Xiomara. Your question is the number one. What are your privacy settings on Facebook? Esa es la pregunta que ustedes van a discutir. Ask and answer. Group number two. Angelica, Esmeralda, Gabriela, and Rebecca. How can using social networking sites invade your privacy? That's your question. Number three, what do you think about being fingerprinted when you enter a country? That one goes to group number three, Ana Maritza, Braulio, Elisa, and Katia, okay? That's your question, guys. So, uh, groups are open, you can go there. I just want one answer, one, one explanation per group. Una respuesta explicadita, okay? per group. You will have five minutes to work in groups and create, construct your idea. 
I will ask one of you, wait for him, one from each group to tell me. Okay, guys? So, five minutes. ¿Qué, ¿Cuál es su contacto? Ah, sí, ¿eh? <laughs> María Teresa, we don't ask that. That's not a good question. Ay, no Yo me la puedo. <laughs> okay, I need you to start trying to use English, okay? Try to use English. Ajá, bla, ajá. pero... Teacher, en donde dice, ¿cuál es tu configuración de privacidad en Facebook? O sea, tenemos que como poner los, los puntos de... Ok, de... now, eh, in this case... Eh, give me just a second. I'm making a report about uh, Marvin. Ok, now, what you're going to do is this. In your case, give me a suggestion. In the case of you, can modify it. Imagine that uh, I have everything public. You ask me, hey, what are your configuration? And I tell you, oh, everything's public. Okay, I need you to give me suggestions. Quiero que me hagan sugerencias. How would you, what do I need to change? Que necesito cambiar? Okay. I mean, I, I'm not that good at, at Facebook. I don't use it. Yo no lo uso. Cuenta de privacidad, no sé. Okay. Explain it to me in English. <laughs> Bye. Explique. ¿Qué sería? Hi, teacher. Hello. Lenguaje. Okay, jerseys. How can using social networking sites invite, invade your privacy? Well, if you make too much information public, yeah. people mm -hmm. can get your personal information and your friends or your relatives, right? Okay. Write it down, construct the idea. Bye. No, we need you here. Excelentes penales. Excelentes penales. Say what? Hello, teacher. Hello, teacher. Hello, teacher. Hello. What do you think I about being know. fingerprinted when you enter a country? ¿Qué opinan ustedes? Que le toman la huella cuando no entra a un país. Is it good? Is it bad? Why? ¿Es bueno o malo? ¿Por qué? Es, bueno, es bueno, estábamos diciendo. Es bueno que lo hagan. Why? Bueno, ahí dijo la compañera Elisa que por seguridad, por security. Y la niña Marica, que así se le. Y la niña Marica. Criminal Record. Uh -huh. Criminal Record. Shit. Okay, okay. Criminal record. Criminal record. Eh, evitar control de cuando se dice que secuestran a la gente. Identificar personas. Kidnapping. Kidnapping. Kill? Kidnapping. 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 Uh -huh. ¿Qué se habíamos puesto? Ahorita solamente tenemos que formularla todo en inglés, ¿verdad, Ticho? Yep. Ok. Ah, pues estábamos poniendo.
Let's just wait for everybody to be back. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. Group number one. Okay. Xiomara, tell me, what must be the settings? What do you need to set the settings? Everything public, um, right? No. Estábamos discutiendo la mía. What do you think? Ah. What do you suggest? What do you suggest? Mm, pues, en mi caso, sería mi, mi birthday in privacy. Okay, your birthday in privacy. Why? Por qué? Right. Why do you have, why, por qué? Why do you have um, your birthday on privacy? No sé, así lo puse. Okay, okay, that's fine, that's fine. Okay, thank you, Xiomara. Maria Teresa, what do you think? What other suggestion can you give me? Is privacy. <laughs> Why? Por qué? Um, because it is um, safer. Okay. Because it is safer. Es más seguro. Perfect. Thank you. Yes. Okay. Esmeralda. How can using social networking sites invade your privacy? Uh, Share, share information about the people and the company and accept the people do you know as not. Okay, thank you. Gabriela, can you add something else? Puede agregarme más? Excuse me, teacher. Can you add something else to what Esmeralda said? Puede agregarme algo más? Hey. The question is, how can using social networking sites invade your privacy? Yeah, uh, share, share my information to one other people. Uh, okay. Uh -huh. Not just with another company. And también sería no sé cómo escribirlo en inglés eh, ni decirlo. Eh, cuando, por ejemplo, eh, alguien configura y directamente, direct, no, cuando las aplicaciones configuran y hacen pública la información. Ok, when companies make public your information. Yeah, that's why we must read the whole thing. Por eso hay que leer todo el acuerdo. La letra chiquita. Yeah, it's always good, you know. Lawyers are tricky people. Oh, oh. Oh. Hi, Atenas. Good evening. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Okay, Katia, tell me, tell me, Katia. What do you think about being fingerprinted when you enter a country? Is it good? Is it bad? Why? It's good because check criminal record for security, okay. for kidnapping, mm -hmm. and for human trafficking. Kidnapping, kidnapping, human kidnapping. traffic. Yeah, mm. those things happen. Those things happen. Okay, you did very well, guys. Let's go to next activity. Here we go. Okay. Let's go back to the manual. 
We are now in page number 30. We have information questions. What do I do? I supervise the production for workforce. Where do you work? I work in the accounting department. When do we go to the meeting, to meetings? We go to meetings two times a week. How do they plan the marketing? They investigate the customer's needs. What time do you take breakfast? I take breakfast at 8 a.m. Okay, now you have to create questions based on the answers. What are we going to do? Oh, it's very simple. You're going to start a question like, I have to write a report about the production every Friday. Okay, perhaps here you can ask, when, when do you have to write a report? Or when do you write reports? Remember, something very interesting like when do you write reports something very interesting that you have to remember I go to the moment that is this the structure is the same the structure hasn't changed the structure has not changed you see auxiliary plus subject plus Verb plus complement plus question mark. La estructura, si ustedes ven la clase de ayer, es la misma. What is the only change? Ah, the only change is this. Look, that we have add a WH at the beginning. Que le pusimos una WH right at the beginning you see wh auxiliary subject verb complement question mark but it's the same structure the only thing we did was add the wh at the beginning lo único que hicimos fue agregar la wh al inicio el resto es la misma estructura que había yesterday and last week el día de ayer y toda la semana okay so this is an example. What are you going to do? Use these expressions in order to create questions, okay? Like number two, I work in the blue building. This one is easy, okay? You have the expressions here. You need to do it. Let's see. Okay. You need to make the questions. Go to the group. Two minutes. Hurry up. Let's do it.
producto? What do they think? What do you, what do you think? What do? Uh, what do what do they think? Create the new product, ponemos. No, no le ponemos, ponemos what do they think, porque ahí le contestan que ellos crean productos, nuevos productos. Lo do, sí. O lo pongamos what do they think. What do they think? What do they think? De sin, ajá. Y ahí ellos contestan que Design. 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 Vaya, la última. They have meeting the scouts. Ahí sería. Ellos tienen. Pero ellos tienen. Porque con nosotros todos sobre. Oye, ahí está hablando que están hablando de qué. <ríe> meeting. Meeting. ¿Qué significaba? Meeting reunión que ellos tienen una reunión que hablan sobre la inflación sobre como dinero cosas así de, de finanzas ellos tienen una reunión quizás le están preguntando we, ahí podemos ¿Por poner when do when do cuando when do when do meeting when do meeting Podemos poner eso. Es que están preguntando dónde tienen la reunión o algo así. Sí. Porque ellos tienen. Ah, porque ellos están diciendo, ellos tienen una reunión. Ellos tienen una reunión. Por, pero por, porque. Eh... Nosotros hablamos sobre la inflow of, no sé qué dice. Pero como que le está diciendo eh, que están. Ingresos, una egresos. Inflows, outflows. Sería guay entonces. Hablando de ingresos. Okay. It can be, it can be, the, the answers actually in that case can vary. La respuesta puede variar. I mean, the question can be, uh, why do they have a meeting? Uh -huh. En este bueno. caso, en este caso, realmente si usted se fija, la respuesta nos introduce el because. Uh -huh. ¿Y qué les dije yo hace unos minutos? Que el because nos obliga a que la pregunta sea why. Why. Um, why. Why. why dijo. Eh, why do why they. Do I? No, why do they. Porque why te hay que poner they? el sujeto. Ajá, why, why do, do they, they. Have a meeting. Have a meeting. Have a meeting. Bye. Uh, Ana Maritza, le mandé unos mensajitos aquí hay. What do you work? What do you work? Yes. 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 Oops, sorry. Let's do the exercise.
Okay, let's see. We have here, create questions based on the answers. I have to write a report about the production every Friday. Okay, question. Let's see. Like, when do you have to write reports? This one could be an option. Esta podría ser una opción. Okay, let's see. Katia, which option do you have? What do you have here? ¿Qué tienes? Tengo, where do you work? Where do you work? Number one. Number one. Number one. Yeah. A la respuesta quiere que le diga. Well, the question. La pregunta que usted creó para la number one. Uh, you didn't. Pensé, pensé que ese era el ejemplo que había puesto. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Okay, no, it's okay, it's okay. It's just that in some of them, you can have more than one. En algunas de ellas puede tener más de una. Thank you, Katia. Rebecca, number two. Okay, teacher. Um, where do you do you work? Okay, where do you work? Perfect. Where do you work? <laughs> Excellent. Okay, let's see. Xiomara, what you got for number three? Um, I work. I no, Number three. What time, what time me do we start working? Mm. Do you? Look, do you? Start, start work. No. What time me do we start working? Okay. Vale. Le aclaro. Lo que sucede es esto. Eh, ¿A qué horas comenzamos nosotros a trabajar? Y yo mismo me contesto. The question usually works like this. Normalmente cuando me preguntan usted, contesto yo. Cuando me preguntan ustedes, contesto nosotros. Right? Well, o sea, okay. Por ejemplo, ¿dónde trabaja usted? En um, Pharmacy, la vida. Ok, la pregunta en inglés, where do you work? Uh -huh. Bye. Xiomara, ahora le pregunto en español. ¿Dónde trabajan ustedes? In nosotros the trabajamos. The right? Nosotros trabajamos in the pharma, en la farmacia La Vida. Ahora escuche la misma pregunta, pero plantea de una manera distinta. Xiomara, ¿dónde trabajan eh, Katia y usted? En la farmacia La Vida. Y usted, si le hacemos larga, podría contestarme. Katia y yo trabajamos. Ah, en farmacia. ¿Se fijó, la cómo, ¿Se fijó cómo es la pregunta? Sí. ¿Dónde trabajan ustedes? Ok. That's okay. why in the question I have, what time do you? Okay. In this case, the you is plural. Got it? Thank you, teacher. No, thanks to you. Thank you. María Teresa, number four. Maria Teresa. Yep. What do you do in your work? Oh, perfect. What do you do in your work? That's nice. We design and others create the new product. Okay. That's an option. Very good. It's not just the only option. Uh, does anybody got a different option? Thank you. It's perfect, Maria Teresa. Alguien tiene otra opción? For number four. Teacher, y solamente what do you do? No se puede. Yes, you can do it like that. What do you do? Perfect. Yes, you can do it like that. No problem. Okay, number five. Number five. Atenas, help me with number five. 
Ay, no, teacher, esta la tengo mala, pero bueno. Why do you do meeting? Why? Look at this. Look at this. Look at the screen. Why do they? They do. Have... Uh -huh. A meeting. Why do they have a meeting? Oh, they have a meeting because we have to talk about the inflows and outflows. The key here is this. La clave acá es esta. Because. Yo les mandé por ahí, ¿verdad? Que si teníamos el why, contestábamos because. Por ende, si tenemos el because, the question goes with why. Right? Questions? No questions. Perfect. Excellent. Don't worry, guys. We are going to continue working with this. No preocupen. Vamos a ir trabajando con esto. Okay, next exercise. Okay, you have to create questions with the WH words provided below. Then ask the questions to a partner. Okay, right now you need to create questions using what, when, where, why, and who. Okay, you need to create questions using these. Vamos a crear preguntas utilizando esto. Right now, what, when, where, why, and who. Remember, you can find it in page number 30 in your manuals. Okay, think about questions. Answer, la pregunta with what. Let's see, Gabriela, hello. Hello. Okay, ask me one question using what? Mm. What is your favorite color? My favorite color is black. Thank you. What about yours? What is your favorite color, Gabriela? I have four favorite colors. Oh my gosh. Okay, <laughs> tell me then. White, black, blue sky, and pink. Sky blue. Ah, sky blue. Okay, and pink. Hmm, interesting. Ah, and just forget the purple. Okay, that's fine. Thank you. <laughs> okay, okay, that's fine. That's fine. Angelica asked me one question using what? Repeat. Ask me one question. I have a pregunta. Sería, pero con todas las que con las que puso ahí, con todas las Anyone, cualquiera. Uh, where do you work? Ooh. I work in, let's see, one, two, three, four different places, my dear. Oh, I got God. four different jobs. Yo tengo cuatro trabajos. So, uh, let's see, I work at a school, I work in, for Insafort, I work for a city hall, trabajo con una alcaldía. And I also teach uh, private classes. So I got four different places. Thank you, Angelica. Now let's see. Elisa, ask me one question, please. Mm, ¿Cómo se dice? How do you say desc mm, descansa? Rest. Rest. Mm, sería. When do you rest? Mm. I think when I die. Yo creo que cuando me muera. There's not much time for resting, actually. Yeah, a lot of people ask me that. Don't worry, don't worry. Thank you, Lisa. Good question. Okay. 
Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Esmeralda, one question for me, please. Yes, please. Um, what is your free time favorite? What is your what? Uh, free time, was it? And it's been Oh, what is your free time? Yeah, my uh -huh. free time. Well, I have like half an hour in the afternoon. Tengo como media hora por la tarde. And sometimes Sundays, a veces los domingos. Oh, wow. Sure. Yeah, it's just like, well, yes, yeah, sometimes because like in starting September, comenzando en septiembre, I will be working... Sundays too, voy a estar trabajando domingos. I, I have a student that is waiting for me for that time. Tengo una alumna que estamos esperando para esa fecha, so I can start teaching her. But that's a different project because I'm preparing someone for talk. Estoy preparando a alguien para talk, so it's different. Oh. Let's see. ¿En serio? Mm. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So let's see. Well, there's not much time. Thank you. Now let's see another question. Still, who? Okay, free. Who wants to ask me something? Free. 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 Yes, a mí me iba a hacer yo. Ah, well, you see, you see. You were too slow. Muy bien. In who December 17th. How old are you? And how are you? How years? old? Oh, I am 42 years old. I am 42. Yes, Ana Maritza? 42. Yep. What is your favorite fruit? My favorite fruit? Oh, it's dragon fruit. Okay. And, and bananas. I'm a monkey. Okay. I like bananas. Thank you. Can you repeat when is your birthday? My birthday is in December 17th. 17 de December. Yep, December 17th. Oops, give me a second. I'm texting. December 17th. That. Okay, well. It was very interesting class. I hope you enjoy it. Don't worry, tomorrow we are going to practice more WH questions, okay? So uh, I need you to please bring two questions for tomorrow. Preparen dos preguntas for me, okay? Using WH. So think about them. Bring them prepared because you are going to ask me. Mañana me las preguntas, okay? So let me get the final attendance, guys. Uh, uh, uh. Teacher. Yes. Un ejemplo de why. <laughs> why? Sí. Why do you study English? ¿Por qué estudio inglés? That's one example. ¿Por qué qué? Why do you study English? Okay. Ana Maritza Flores Arbellón. 
Present. Angélica Guadalupe Tobar de Melgar. Present. Braulio Enrique Hernández Susa. Present, teacher. Brian Alexander Rivas Sánchez. Claudia Teresa Flamenco. Elisa Saraí Martínez Ramírez. Present. Esmeralda Lisbeth Vázquez Silva. Present, teacher. Gabriela Guadalupe Celaya Silas. Present. Karen de Sirene de Sánchez. Catherine Beatriz Morales Calzadilla. Katia Estefanía Pineda Alvarado. Present, teacher. Uh, María Teresa González de Lemos. Present, teacher. Marvin Gabriel Romero Cubías. Present, teacher. Mirna Atenas Vanega Zamora. Present. Rebeca del Carmen Morales Molina. Present. Víctor Manuel Reyes Carvajal. Xiomara Chamilet Mendoza Mendoza. Present teacher. Thank you. Hey guys, a pleasure to have you here. See you tomorrow. Have a good night. Night. Good night. Good night. See you tomorrow. Bye. See you tomorrow. Good night. Bye, everybody. Bye. Bye, teacher. Namarik sa hello. Hello. How are you? How are you? ¿Qué tal? ¿Cómo estás? Pues un poco cansada. I can imagine. I can imagine. Okay. How do you feel the class? ¿Cómo vamos con las clases? Um, difficult. Is it difficult? Okay, don't worry, don't worry. No se preocupe. Right at the beginning, it's like this. Eh, al inicio nos pasa eso, de que se siente bastante difícil. Y si algunos compañeros van un poquito más adelantaditos, se siente peor, right? Yes. Okay, now, eh, necesito que me haga un ejercicio. En la medida de lo posible, hmm, no sé qué tengo acá. La voy a poner en mood. En mi otro momento porque hay un sonido que se me está metiendo. Perdón que la señas, pero hay un sonido de su lado que se me está viniendo. Ok. Eh, I have an exercise for you. Yo tengo un ejercicio. Eh, if it's possible for you, I would like you to review in the manual the, the, the points that are the most difficult. ¿Qué puntos son aquellos que siempre usted? ¿Qué más le han costado entender? Take notes, tome nota de ellos. And prepare the question, prepare las preguntas específicas. And let me know when you are ready. Que me acuerdo esta lista. So we can stay one night, así nos quedamos una noche por momentos, 10 eh, minutos, le explico un tema. And I can also send you extra information, o le puedo enviar información extra que le ayude a aclarar sus dudas o que le ayude a mejorar en aquellas áreas que siente usted como que está costando un poquito más. What do you think? ¿Qué le parece? Yeah. Sí, está bien. Me parece. Ok. Because, porque voy a comenzar a presionar un poquito más para speaking. Ok. Ok. But the idea is this, la idea es esta, la idea es que hablemos más. Eh, mi objetivo es ayudarle. Para ello, lo que más necesito yo es que usted me diga, mire, esto sí no lo entendí, no le capté, ¿ok? Y así okay. podemos ir viendo si usted necesita, o si quiere vocabulario específico de un tema, también me dice, y yo con gusto le ayudo, ¿ok? Ok, thank así you. Que, muy importante acá de que nos comuniquemos. Eh, puede comunicarse conmigo a través del WhatsApp, del chat del WhatsApp. Eh, solo me pone su nombre porque tengo muchísima gente, entonces me, se me escapa. ¿Ok? okay y no todo el mundo registrado con nombre. So, 
Thank you, Ana Maritza. A pleasure to have you here. See you tomorrow. And don't forget, take notes. Tome nota me avisa. Okay? Okay. Thank you, teacher. No, thanks to you. Have a good night. Good night. Bye. Bye.
Oh, that's it for tonight. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.